Let's do a little bit of a sweeping slash arpeggio lesson here. This is a cool little shape, one of my favorites. Um, sounds like this. <laughs> An interesting sound because it's got no thirds in it so it's essentially just um, a big fat power chord type thing it's just all first fifths ninths and things like that so it looks like this starting at the 12th fret fourth string start to the fifth so 12 14 on the um, third string I actually play it like this so I can get these three notes 12 14 and then 15 on the second string and then you go down you, with your first stringer and play the, uh, what the hell was that? First finger at the 12th fret on the first string. So that's just a first, a fifth, an octave, and then a ninth. Even that's a cool sound. Just a pain in the butt to sweep. Then I reach up and grab, in this case, the 17th fret on the first string, so. It's a really cool open kind of a sound. The other good thing is you can kind of move it around to practically anywhere in any sort of order and it still sounds good. So here's one example of how I move that around is... doing it at the 12th, 14th, 15th and 17th frets. It's a good little sound. And that's just doing each one and then moving up, doing the next shape. Another way you can do it is to slide up, alternating by sliding on the top part of the arpeggio, the highest note, and then moving on the bottom note. So we get this. Okay, here's another little twist on that idea. It sounds a bit like this. Something like that. It's using some slides. Same kind of an idea, moving up on the first string and then on the fourth string, but using slides to make it sound a bit slippery. So slowed down, it's like this. Mm -hmm. 